All right, welcome to the mini lesson on order of symmetry. Sometimes they might ask you on a math problem, what is the order of symmetry of this uh, shape? And what that means is how many times can you spin the shape around and have it look exactly the same as the way that it started? And uh, you're going to count the number of times on the spin, including uh, the number, you know, including the time when it gets back to its original position. So I'm going to show you several shapes that have order of symmetry. Hopefully that'll help you enough so you can recognize when shapes do not have order of symmetry. And then we'll talk about what number that would be for each one of these. Okay, first I have a couple of rectangles right here. Uh, I, I did two of the exact same shapes so you could see as I'm spinning it when it looks the same as what it started. So you can see these two shapes look exactly the same. They're called congruent. And as I spin this shape around, if I stop right here, it does not look like the shape below because the shape below is flat and long and this one's tall and skinny right but when I get right to here notice where my arrow is right now where I'm dragging this around this shape is actually upside down at this point in time but it looks exactly like the other shape below exactly like it did when it started so that's one and then I make it back to where I started here at the beginning and that's two so the order of symmetry for this shape let me get my pen here is two. All right, how about this square here? Let's take a look at the order of symmetry for this. I'm going to move this one over a little bit. Notice they look exactly the same to start, and I'm going to pretend like this is a perfect square. I don't know if it is, but as I turn around, it looks exactly the same right now. So that's one, and then I come around a little bit more. That's two, three, and then back to the beginning, four. And so the order of symmetry for this square is the number four. All right, let's take a look at the triangle. Can you figure out what that one's going to be? Okay, these two triangles look exactly alike as it spins around and it gets to right there. That's one, comes around a little bit further. That's two, they look exactly the same. And then back to the beginning, that's three. Notice that we have it, on these regular figures, a square is a regular quadrilateral. A triangle, uh, this equilateral triangle, is a regular triangle. That it's the order of symmetry is the same as the number of sides. That doesn't always work. It only works on these regular figures like this. This is a regular pentagon, but this rectangle is not a regular shape because it's long and flat. All right, on this last one, uh, let me get back to my arrow. Here's a pentagon. These shapes look exactly the same. I'm going to start spinning. When I get right to here, the shapes look exactly the same. Uh, so it's, that's going to be one, two, three, four, and five back to the beginning. And so you can see that the order of symmetry for this pentagon is five. Thanks for watching.